Hey guys, it's Paulie with JMP Cycles. Today we're going to be talking about the basics of motorcycle performance. Now, to my left, this is the stuff that everyone starts out with your stage one kit. You got slip ons and an air cleaner. With that, you also put a tuner. That's where you have to really think about what you want to do in the future because your tuner is going to be based on that. Now there's piggyback tuners that are awesome. They're great for the guys that just want this little stage one setup. That's fine, but you don't want that if you're going to spend a lot of money down the road doing other stuff because you're not going to have the tunability. So if you are going to build your engine, you got to make a plan for that as well. Are you going to want a horsepower motor or a torque motor? What does that mean? Well, horsepower is kind of like a long distance runner. It goes on for a long ways. So power comes in later in the RPM range. Torque motor, it's like a power lifter. Dude, they can throw 600 pounds up bench pressing, but he can only do it a couple of times, but he does it instantly. That's your torque. A torquey motor comes in instant off the line. Horsepower motor winds out further. To give you an example, we took a brand new 2017 Milwaukee 8 Street Glide, put it on the dyno to see what it would do, because these bikes feel really fast for a stock bike. You got tons of like off the line acceleration. They feel good all around town. Put it on the dyno, I was kind of surprised it only made 74 horsepower. However, it made 98 foot pounds of torque. That's why that bike feels so good. So you, you need to think about that. Do you only care about running around town? That's gonna be part of your plan. Also, don't just buy something because it's the biggest you can do. Putting the giant cam in your bike, that's not gonna help you at all if you didn't do anything else. Yeah, you're gonna get performance gains, but you're not gonna run efficiently. If you plan on doing a big bore kit, don't buy a small cam to begin with. We've all heard the term blueprinted engines. That is just it. There's a blueprint, there's a plan. You start from the foundation, work your way up, and make sure all your parts work together. You don't want to end up with a hodgepodge mess that you've got thousands of dollars in and doesn't perform as good as your buddy's stock new bike. So that being said, make a plan, go out there and ride your bikes hard. I'm Paulie with JMP Cycles. Ride them, don't hide them, and ride it like you can fix it.